Installing and testing for leaks with the Uptime Diesel Intake System Tester is a relatively simple process. Most modern engines use what's commonly called a Marmon flange. These come in different sizes depending on the engine make and model or turbocharger manufacturer. First, disconnect the V-clamp from the Marmon flange and separate the turbo outlet from the pipe. Determine which end of the tester is going to be attached and fully open the tap, screw inwards in the center of the tester. Now, using the V-clamp, connect the tester to the outlet pipe and tighten securely. Attach the safety chain and secure it to something solid like the exhaust manifold. If there is a clamp failure, the pipe and or tester are restrained from becoming a missile. Use caution when working around or near this pipe. Connect the regulator onto the tester and then connect workshop air pressure to the regulator. There should be no air supply into the system. Open the tap on the regulator and slowly adjust the regulator to approximately 10 PSI. Allow the system to absorb the air supply and if there are no major leaks, it will begin to build pressure on the gauge. If pressure does not build, an engine cylinder could be on overlap and the engine requires barring over manually. This can be done while testing is in progress. Do not use the starter motor to crank the engine. Any major leaks will be heard or felt at this low pressure. If any are found, identify what they are and close the air supply tap and release the air pressure from the system. Repair or replace the leaking parts. Once completed, turn the air supply on again. Slowly increase to 15 and then 20 PSI. Spray soapy water on all hoses, clamps, pipes and charge cooler. Foam bubbles will appear where there are leaks. Listen for high-pitched noises that can be heard from smaller leaks. Again, release the air pressure from the system and repair or replace parts. Repeat the previous test and increase to 25 PSI through to approximately 30 PSI. Make sure not to continually activate the pressure protection valve. If there are any more leaks, repeat the previous steps. This is the final stage of testing. By this point, there should be no leaks in the system. With testing now completed, turn off the air supply and drain the air pressure from the system before removing the tester from the pipe. Reattach the pipe onto the turbo outlet and tighten the V-clamp. On engines without the Marmon flange, the hose is disconnected off the turbo outlet pipe directly and clamped around the matching sized knurled surface of the tester. When refitting this hose, we suggest double clamping if possible or replace the clamp. This is due to possible clamp failure once the truck is returned to service as the clamp has been re-stressed when tightened. As you can see, the Uptime Diesel Intake System Tester is easy to use and has been specifically developed for the efficient diagnosis and testing of all the components of charge air-cooled diesel engines used on highway trucks and coaches.